Hi friends, welcome to my channel Lotus Geek. In this tutorial, we're gonna fix an error in which Windows stuck at this welcome screen and you are not going to log in or getting an password box. Before proceeding, I request you to please click on the subscribe button to continue watching more such tech and how-to videos. Now let's go ahead and proceed with the resolution. The very first thing that you need to perform is to press and hold the shift key and then power off your computer with the power button. Make sure you continue to hold the shift key to turn off your system and then again restart your PC and con while continuing holding the shift key so that your system opens the advanced recovery mode of your PC. I'll go ahead and perform the same. Once your computer restarts, this is the welcome screen you will get. From here, click on the troubleshoot option and then choose the advanced options. In advanced options, you need to click on uninstall updates. From uninstall updates, choose one by one. First one is choose the latest feature update and then choose the second option, latest quality updates. I mean to say that you need to uninstall both these updates one by one to fix this issue. 99% problem will be resolved by performing or by uninstalling latest Windows updates. If still the problem is not resolved, we are going to proceed to the second step. In second step, again restart your system and comes to the same screen which is this troubleshoot screen. In troubleshoot again choose the advanced options. And from here choose startup settings. In startup settings again click on the restart button you are getting over here. Now here these nine options are available in front of you. Choose the option number fifth which is enable safe mode with networking. And you can choose the number keys from F1 to F9 as shown over here. The option we are going to choose is the fifth option. So I will go ahead and press the key. F5 to start or to enable safe mode with networking. Now type in the password because in safe mode you can easily be logged in into your account. Now you can see that the windows is open in safe mode which is clearly shown in every corner of the windows. Now simultaneously press windows and R key to open the run command and type here service sys.msc and hit the enter button. Now here you need to locate a service named as credential manager. It will be in the alphabetical view. Double click to open it. And here in the startup type, make sure you choose the option disabled. And from here, click on the stop button to stop the service at once. Hit apply and OK button. This one is the second method that you need to perform. And with this, you need to perform another command. For that, again simultaneously press Windows and R key and type here CMD. And now hit the enter button. We are going to check your system files also to make sure there is not any corrupted file present in your system. Type here a command sfc space slash scan now and then hit the enter button. This command will take up to 10 minutes so just be patient and let this work let this command works for you. In the meantime, I will go ahead and provide you the other command also. Again, open the run command, type cmd and open another command prompt. Type here dism space slash online space slash cleanup image space slash restore health and again hit the enter button. You need to perform these two commands one by one 
do not perform these two commands simultaneously. Just be patient and let each command works for you. By doing these three methods, your problem will be surely resolved. If still the problem persists, kindly comment below for more ways for the resolution. So that's it about it friends. If you like my video, I request you to please click on the subscribe button and share my channel as much as you can. Thank you so much friends. Thank you for watching.